and I've got a few more albums for you to look at. Um, they're made of different things. This one particular one I've got showing here, this is actually the material here. It's very beautiful. I'll untie that in a second. But this is made out of a an envelope. It's the 9 by 12 um, manila envelopes that I used. So they really hold a lot of things. I guess the hardest part was to get this to, to hold down and, and uh, work properly. So what I did was I used Velcro so that it would be stronger. So you can see the Velcro strips in here. So there's three Velcro strips on it. And we will open this up and we will. This is the inside of the envelope, the front page and then folding over in the inside of the envelope. It's then got a large signature in the center and then the back of the envelope. And then here it opens up so that there is a pocket in here, quite a, quite a good size pocket actually. And that's from your front cover there. So this will hold a lot of things. So we'll go quickly through the uh, signature and let me just try to get it here so that you can see it. Okay, so um, not a lot of distressing done on this one, but there is a lot of room in it. And it's pretty cool, I think. Did it with some decorative uh, papers and also some washi tape and some cloth flowers. This is a um, doily, but it's a long and narrow doily, so the rest of it's towards the back. Plenty of room to write, work in. Lots and lots of room to put pictures if you want to. And come on, open up here. There we go. All right, so. And this again was, was fun to make. I loved it, the challenge of making new things. And this was definitely a challenge, but once you get onto it, you're fine. So then we've got some uh, partial pages in here. This one being here and this one being here. And then we just keep going towards the back of it. So that is the envelope one. I'll close that up and I have attached a tie to it so that just for double safety you can tie this up. Now I'll be putting this up on, on my eBay um, probably today or tomorrow. We'll see what it brings. All right now this is just beyond sweet. Let me move this down so you can see the picture. This is material and what I did was I put it on a backer board. Can you see that? How darling that is. Let me untie it first. You can see it. Okay, look at her. Too sweet. This one is going to come with one signature, but it can hold a total of three signatures. So it's made with um, Sizzix scoreboard extra large die um, by uh, Eileen Hall and it scores it for you and such. I'm having a little problem with the die. Uh, I'm hoping someone's going to be able to help me because rather than scoring it wants to cut but nevertheless this one did get done. So inside it's mainly girly girly. Look at attached it with some yarn. It's got some glitter on it. Got to have glitter in a girly girl. And these are our pages. Pretty basic, but plenty of room for lots and lots of things. Look at that little princess. So um, this is this was fun to make once I kind of got onto it. But like I said, it'll have the three signatures, and it will of course close this way so you can see there's a pretty decent sized spine and it will fit three full signatures and it will come with this one for sure I don't know if we'll get the other one done or not and this next one is um this is more of what I showed you the other day this is the uh, duck cloth material and um 
it's kind of a shabby chic type of thing, but this is another travel one. This is made, the material that I showed you the other day, this is that material, um, and I, I copied it on my um, printer, and then I dubbed it onto a piece of material. This is what it came out looking at. I think it's pretty cool. So this is the front of it. And we're gonna, we've got the twine. And let me show you the back of it. So this is the baseline inside, but this is just kind of a cloth flower. And this is where we're attaching our string to close this up and to hold it. These cloth ones can hold so much. They just amaze me. So here we go. We have two pockets here, like we did on the other ones. And then we have another pocket up here. So, and we open it up. And here is the signature, which I'll show you in a minute. And also here is, there are two pockets. And there's a holder for a little pad of paper for your little sticky notes. So you just slide them into the little holder and you can change them out. And then it's got a pen holder and a pen. And this is our signature here. Okay, so the signatures are basically the same that you've seen before, but there's a lot of room in them. A lot of writing can be done in them. Can be, this can be used for travel, but it doesn't have to be. And we have some sewing pages in there. So I guess it's more towards the junk journal part. Some lined. Somebody was telling me that they really like the lined material, lined uh, because they can write easier on it. But anyways, this is the ba uh, belly band here that so that you can fit your get in there, little thing, your signature in here. And you can carry a lot of other things too. As you can see, when you close this up, there is plenty, plenty of room. I mean, you could stack it this high if you wanted to. So those are the little last couple ones that I've started and finished up. And as I said, I will put them on my eBay um, in a day or so. But anyways, thanks for joining me and I'll let you know when we're ready. Bye-bye.